How to recover your Amazon account. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. I am Bimo from App Guide, and in this guide video, I'm simply going to guide you on how you can actually recover your Amazon account. But before we get started, if you are new to our channel, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And without any further ado, let us get started with today's video. So first of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to simply open any of the browser which you have and in the search box, I'm going to simply type in Amazon.com. Once you go to Amazon.com, make sure the URL is correct. I'm also going to leave them down in the description box. So go ahead and simply be sure to check them out. And I'm going to tap on Amazon.com right over here. And you can see that this is how the home interface of the Amazon website actually looks like. Now. What if you have lost access to your account or maybe you've actually forgotten your password or maybe you're trying to reactivate your account after deletion? If that is the case, then first of all, we will discuss what we can do if we've actually forgotten our password. So on the top right hand side, you'll be able to see this sign in button. So here we are going to simply tap on go ahead and tap on this orange button which says sign in. So I'm going to tap on the sign in screen right over here. And as we go to sign in screen, let's say we've actually forgotten our password. What we can do is at the bottom of the screen, you'll find an option called Need Help. You can simply tap on Need Help. And as we tap on Need Help, you can see an option which says Forgot Your Password. So go ahead and simply tap on Forgot Your Password button. As you tap on Forgot Your Password, you want to make sure that you actually do have access to the email or phone number which was associated with your Amazon account. Because if you don't have that, then you don't have any way to recover your account. So if you've got the phone number, go ahead and simply enter your phone number in the box. Or if you got your email, then go ahead and enter your email. Once you do that, at the bottom, you can go ahead and simply tap on the continue button. And as you tap on continue, it says us to verify using an OTP code. So check your mobile phone and see whether you've actually received a message or not. If you have received a message, then go ahead and simply enter the OTP code which you have received on your phone. And once you've received your OTP code, you can go ahead and tap on the continue button at the bottom of the screen. And as you tap on continue here, it, you can say it is asking us to create a new password which must be at least 6 characters. At the bottom it says at least 8 characters, a combination of numbers and letters is best. Do not use the same password you have used with us previously and any other type of tips you want to go ahead simply check them out. I'm going to simply go and select a new password which is very easy for me as well as convenient and memorable. So don't, so make sure that you don't forget this password, make sure it is an easy one but at the same time that nobody can guess. Once you enter your new password and re-enter your new password again, go ahead and simply tap on this button which says save changes and sign in. So we are going to tap on save changes and sign into our account. And as you can see, we have successfully logged into our Amazon account right over here on the screen. Which means that we have successfully recovered our Amazon account. But if you're trying to recover your Amazon account after deletion or something like that, then we recommend you watch our other video on where we show you what you can do if you've actually lost access to your account, you've actually deleted your account and how you can regain access back to it. So we hope this video was really helpful and if it did help you, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. If you've got any more questions, queries or doubts regarding this, simply also make sure to leave them down in the comment section. As always, thank you very much for watching and see you soon in our next video.